Hey everyone, it's Sabrina. Today I'm going to be doing a waterfall braid tutorial. And this is a tutorial that will involve French braiding again. I don't know if you guys watched my How to French Braid video, but if you did, I hope that helped you guys out. But this is a really pretty hairstyle that kind of gives a twist to your normal everyday straight hair, I guess. If you have straight hair, you can do it with curly hair as well, but I'm going to be using straight hair. And um, for this tutorial, I'm going to be using a flat iron. And this um, flat iron is from Flat Iron Experts. I don't know if you guys have heard about that company. Um, but they're a really um, great company brand that sells kind of all types of hair tools um, from curlers, straighteners, hair dryers, and stuff like that. So they have tons of hair products and it's just a company online. All types of straighteners, all types of curlers and stuff that work best for your hair. So you can just check that out and see which one you'd like best. And so um, I have the Avanti Ultra Straightener. A nano Titanium Nano Ceramic Straightener. It's 1 and 3 8 inch plates. Um, and it's 400, it heats up to 450 degrees uh, Fahrenheit, and it's universal voltage. That's good. Um, yeah, it just came in this box right here. And I guess I can tell you a little bit more about it. Um, I have like instructions. Um, it tells you like what, how to use your iron, of course, and it tells you what, what heating is best for your hair. So if you have delicate, thin hair, um, 280 to 340 is best. Normal hair, 340 to 380. So I have normal hair. Um, mine's not thick. It's not um, thin. It's just normal. Um, so I'm putting it to 340 is the smallest number. So that's what I'm putting it. And I'm just going to be heating this up. And it just looks like this. There is, um, you guys can see two different plates on the inside. One is white, one is red. And um, then on this side, there's kind of like a mirrored plate. And it's really, really cool how it's designed. I think it's awesome. And it just, it looks like this. So, yeah, it's a pretty thin straightener. It's very nice. Um, I've tried it. I tried it this morning, actually. And it just smooths out your hair really nicely and makes it really nice and soft and shiny. So I really love the straightener. Um, I'm excited to be using it, I guess. So um, just to let you guys know, um, Flatiron Experts did contact me. And um, they sent me this straightener just to review and use, I guess. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to be reviewing and using it today and talking about it. And um, again, all opinions are always my own. I'm not being paid to do this. And it's just getting a straightener to talk about it, I guess, and get their company out there. So, um, and plus, I'm just trying to, like, help you guys out because I know um, many of you guys want to know trusted internet sites or just trusted brands that have good straighteners. So I know for a fact that Flat Iron Experts is a pretty good brand, and I've heard only good things about it. So I was very excited when they contacted me. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with the tutorial. Um, first of all, you want straight hair. My hair is straightened out. I'm going to straighten, I guess, a little bit of pieces that are flyaway. And again, sorry about the lighting. It's raining outside, which is awesome. But I had to use, like, the setup because it's really dark. So I also got um, sent this Termal Shine Brilliant Ceramic Heat Protectant. And um, it's by KQC, and it's for silky smooth shine heat protection. Use a flat iron or hair dryer. Um, so, yeah, you just know. It's just a typical heat protectant tamer spray, except for this one is by KQC. And the thing about this is how interesting it smells. Okay, so this, um, when I first put it on, I couldn't believe that it smelled like, it smells like, like guy cologne, which is so weird, but this does smell like that. It's nothing sweet or sugary, it's just like really manly, which is weird, I guess. I don't know if a lot of people will like this scent, but um, in total, this is a really good um, heat protect and tamer spray. I left my hair really nice and shiny and silky, and I like how it works, and I like how it smells. So that's just me. I don't know if you guys like how guy cologne smells, but I do. So it smells good to me. And now um, that I'm done rambling on about the straightener stuff, we can finally go ahead and get started in the tutorial. So first I'm just going to spray my hair. So you just spritz it through your hair. And my whole room just smells like guy cologne. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and um, just start straightening my hair. So this heats up very, very, very quickly. And you guys can see how nicely and smooth it left my hair. And I love about this is that, it, again, it does not catch your hair because it's just like really nice mirror kind of feeling. And it also has like a mirror reflection. Um, so it just, it glides through very smoothly throughout your hair and it leaves your hair very nice and straight. It works really great at straightening your hair. So this would be good for all you girls looking for a straightener that um, will straighten your crazy, frizzy, curly hair. Uh, yeah. Got the straightener and check out the company. I'll just link uh, where it's from in down bar below if you'd like to check it out. If you'd like to check out other company products like that, you can just check out flatironexperts.com. So now we're going to go ahead and get started with the braid. So I'm going to do this on the side of my hair and I'm going to do it with my bangs. I don't really like my bangs. They really um, annoy me and I'm trying to grow them out. So I always try to get them out of my face and sometimes I just, 
I usually just clip them back or you guys know I like to tuck them behind my ear, that's easiest. But sometimes I like to do different stuff to it and I thought why not try this waterfall braid. So I'm going to go ahead and just get started. Uh, what you want to do is split your hair into three sections like you're going to typically French braid it. Um, and you just want to like add hair. Um, you guys know how, how it goes with French braiding. So I'm going to just add a little bit of hair right here. And then I always like to, I like to add it in different sections. Now what you want to do is leave this strand, um, this bottom strand right here, just leave it down. And we're going to continue braiding, um, but grab another section of your hair from right here. So you leave this strand that you were braiding before down, and then you grab another section of your hair and just incorporate it into the braid. And finish it up right here because I got to the end really quickly. So I'm going to go ahead and just braid it into a normal typical braid. So this is what it looks like. Um, again, I guess you guys can see. So you just leave this section out and it kind of has like this waterfall effect. And you can like even like just clip your hair back if you want. Or you can just leave it like this. So it's up to you what you want to do. Um, just to show you guys again how you do it. So I'm just going to grab a section of my hair and just start to braid it typically going back and then I'm going to add a piece of hair and then I'm going to leave this right here, just leave it down and then grabbing another section of my hair I'm going to start braiding again There's different styles, you can leave it like this you can just bobby pin your hair after you finish and you just have kind of just these pieces um, I guess hanging out. So this is a really um, cute hairstyle. Um, very simple, very easy. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little tutorial and thank you so much for watching and I guess I'll see you guys soon. Bye guys!